Hey guys, um, so Mark, Mark Zuckerberg's first patent finally got approved six years later. Um, so basically, uh, it's called dynamically generating a privacy summary. Um, yeah, I'm not going to read you the description of it. I'm just going to give you a brief summary. Basically, the patent protects the way a user's information appears on screen, including how they view the privacy settings. Initially, the patent was rejected for being obvious, but later revisited and now approved. Um, that being said, it is Mark Zuckerberg's first patent. Um, it was submitted in July 2006, um, which is uh, six years ago, which is unfortunate, I guess, for him. Um, but in the past, he did get um, uh, more patents approved. So it's nice, but uh, I really don't understand what this patent is for, though. I mean, why? Like, why would you? Like, there's nothing he can do with this. I mean, I, other than just having another number to to increase in his patent portfolio, I really don't see this actually being implemented or anything. Um, I think it should just been re rejected for obvious, obvious, and then just n not not revis revisited because whoever who, whoever is tr like managing the um the patents just doesn't know what they're doing. Whoever um, rejected it for being obvious should have stayed at the patent office because I is pretty amazing. Whoever approved it is probably the reason why the patent um uh patent trademark world is you know raped harder than like any other market out there. Like if you see the patents that are get approved, it's pretty much like this. Like it's it, it really why I mean I'm so disappointed in the patent uh, office. It's just it's just horrific, you know. Whoever um, um, rejected this, you know, thank you. Whoever approved it, I don't know. Maybe you should, like, go to, like, Guantanamo Bay or something. Anyways, comment, rate, and subscribe.